am the most unforgettable person, or not unforgettable, I'm sorry, forgettable. Um, no, I wasn't here, but we've met. Oh, I'm sorry. It's okay. No, everybody is like, hi, I'm Joey. And I'm like, I know. It's been five fucking times. And I'm sure it's my fault that I'm just really boring. Oh my god, Jim, I am so sorry. I'm sitting there rubbing my ass and thighs, trying to squeeze through the him and this lovely woman here all over his table. Actually, you know what? I'm not sorry. You're welcome. Yeah, I appreciate it. Kevin. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Shit, man. <laughs> now, guys, I'm single. I know that's really hard to believe, especially after what I just said. Um, but um, I'm kind of seeing somebody, and uh, he lives in Alabama. And you know how, like, you start... Um, I'm not to the joke yet, guys. Um, you know how um, when you like somebody... You kind of like do little things for them um like well not i guess not even little things i had a friend uh who he really liked this girl and he ran a half marathon with her what so like i was like i'm gonna you know do something not as drastic with my life um since he's in alabama i joined the clan um, um i have a black cat named kunta kitty and he insists on calling it toby He's like, its name is Toby. And I was like, it's Kunta Kitty, goddammit. Man. <laughs> I just lost my train of thought there. All right. No, um, that's part of the reason I don't smoke weed, guys. I lose my train of thought all the time. And I know I've never smoked it in my life. Um, I know. But one time I tried to roll a rose petal joint because uh, my friend told me it would get me really horny. And my mom walked in and said, you're doing it wrong, you idiot. <laughs> I was like, okay, that's that's a wake up call. Um, and then she did it for me, and no, I'm making the rest of that. Um, but no, like another, I people that are stoned annoy me. Sorry if anybody's stoned right now. Don't talk to me. Um, you annoy me um, because like here's an example. I guess not all stoned people. Not all stoned people. Um, but like. Um, one night I was at Donut Country in Murfreesboro, and I know that you're shocked that I go to an establishment called Donut Country, but I do! And, um, and I was waiting in line, and I heard this guy talking, uh, to the guy behind the counter. A uh, customer was incredibly stoned, and the customer said, So, like, you guys have any, like, glazed donuts? And the guy behind the counter was like, they're coming out at 1, like, in the morning, because it's a 24-hour. And um, he goes, so you have one glazed donut? <laughs> and I just looked over at uh, my boyfriend. I was like, oh, 420, glaze it. And like. <laughs> and uh, this was a boyfriend at the time. Because I was about to say, oh, oh I was going to do that in order. Because I was like, no, I'm just kidding. I'm single. Ah, oh, damn it. I screwed that up. Oh, well. Um. Oh my gosh, Tracy said something earlier about finding a bra that her boobs like won't fall into her dinner plate. That's how I feel about um, thongs, women wearing thongs. I'm like, I have looked for underwear my entire life that have not gone up my ass. Why would you purposely do that? I don't understand. Um, I am have stuff written on my hand like professional oh i'm looking for a job right now you guys um actually i think i have one lined up gonna be a substitute teacher but i was getting my nails done the other day and i um i love men you might not know this but or if you do that's cool whatever if you paint your nails i don't care you live your life but um there is an array of colors and the names are always ridiculous like the color on my toes right now is show us your tips <laughs> and I was like, I want to get a job naming nail polishes. How cool would that be? Like, I'm sitting there choosing, like, oh, um, so this is going to be blood of mine, thine enemies or um, skeet rag today. <laughs> was that too much? All right, no. Okay. All right, I think that's my time, guys. Woo!